Hello, John Adolphe here, and we are at number two or two Elm Ridge Road in DeWitt, actually Jamesville, Jamesville DeWitt School District. This is a beautiful home. And I'll just show you the lay of the land before we head inside this large, spacious, three bedroom, two and a half bath home. I mean, it looks like this came out of a magazine. More importantly, it's in excellent, excellent condition. All right, we'll look around back and then we will head inside. Here we go. All right, there's the back side of the garage. The house has maintenance free vinyl siding, 2,100 square feet. Lot size is 0.57 acres. The dimensions are 154 by 160. You wouldn't know that this home was built in 1950. And in just a second, when we go through it, you'll see why. All right, All right as we, we come in through the front door, we've got our dining room to the right, our kitchen right in front of us. We have a coat closet right here. But I'm going to show you the living room first before we get going here. It is very large, very spacious. Gas fireplace. Imagine especially the fall or in the winter, cozying up here on, sitting right up here on the windowsill. Got vinyl windows. You got the warmth of the fireplace. Carpet is beautiful. A lot you can do in here and what's great is is that people today are looking for this open floor plan concept which this would qualify because you, you know you you've got the living room and then it, again it's very open in the dining room over here and then the kitchen and then the way the rest of the house meanders but I'm gonna go over to the bedroom right here good size bedroom the French door leading outside and talking about open floor I mean it does have pocket doors Okay, to separate the bathroom and your very large walk-in closet. Plenty of counter space right here. Got a stand-up shower. I'll give you a look to see of the tile work. And your bath, your excuse me, your toilet here with again another pocket door for privacy. Alright, let's go take a look at the dining room and kitchen. As you can see, we've got baseboard hot water heat running throughout the house. There's where your dining area is. Again, with lots of light coming in too. Got your breakfast bar right here. Put a couple of stools there. Gas stove, microwave, beautiful cabinets. All stainless, sink, dishwasher, side-by-side -side refrigerator. Now let's take a look at the bedrooms, the other two bedrooms. And I would say this qualifies for being a medium sized bedroom. Again, with two windows, again, letting in as much light as you can. A bathroom down here, full bath. Everything is just, you know, new. Newer, new. It's got that smell and feel and look of it. And then. This being the smallest of the bedroom, and it's not even that small. A lot of times you get into a development and you've got a large medium bedroom, medium bedroom, and then something teeny tiny. All right, let's got ceramic floor throughout. Got another bathroom here, half bath. Sliding glass doors out to a small concrete patio. Again, more, 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 and more windows and doors and windows. See what I'm saying? All vinyl. Let's take a look at the garage. Good sized garage with a garage door opener. Concrete floor, all in fantastic condition. Two more windows there. There's a door right there that leads outside. I was telling you there are three entrances. The one we came through, this one, and then of course the garage door. Here's where you would put your washer and dryer. And let's go ahead and head right down cellar. Something unique about this house, I've never seen any other house, and that is, is we've got this reservoir right here 
Right here, this is a reservoir. Now, you've got a sump pump, okay? And if the sump pump quits, notice that you've got a four inch lip all the way around, which means water would collect if your power went off. Let's say you're in Florida or something, your power went off, the water would have to go rise up four inches in this like reservoir area before it would start to spill over if it ever did uh, onto your floor, which is very, very cool. Okay, you got your hot water tank, which is connected into your boiler, which is um, very efficient in respect to uh, saving money in heating your water. And then we just got a, another room area, work area, whatever. Okay. Well, thank you very much for taking your time to take a tour of 2 Elmridge Road. And for those of you who feel inspired after seeing this video that this is something you want to take a closer look at, give us a call at 695-6434 for your own private exclusive tour. And remember, as always, real estate is awesome.